guys, Gina here. Behind this huge box. You guys, I am so excited. The bicycle company wrote me and said that they had seen some of my uh, die cut videos from this past Halloween. And they said, hey, we have some awesome reproductions. We'd love to send you some. Would you like them? Well, heck yes, of course. I love the Bicel Company and it's so awesome. They've been around for 120 years. Can you believe it? And it's still family run. How cool is that? These guys have Halloween, Christmas, Easter, Valentine's Day. They also have party decorations. They have everything. So if you need a paper good for an event or a party or a holiday, these are your guys. So they sent me a couple of pictures and said, these are some of the products that we're gonna be sending you. But you guys, I think they sent me a few more. <laughs> Look at the size of this box. Oh my gosh. Oh, you guys, we are going to be unboxing for days, but I am so excited. And I thought I would share all of it with you guys and see what they sent and let's get to it because I'm so super duper excited. So I guess what I'll do is I'll just oh, put the box down here and then kind of like a grab bag, I'll just reach in and pull something out and we'll talk about it. This box should be a mixture of Halloween and Christmas. And oh my goodness, I love both holidays so much. So this is just beyond anything right now. Oh. Oh my gosh, you guys, okay, I'm not even gonna look. There, I see ya. Whoa! <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. Yay! I'm so excited! All right, here we go, first thing. What is this? Oh, it's Christmas, you guys! Oh my gosh! Look at these angels! Even the card stock for the advertising is so beautiful. The Bicel Company has manufactured party goods and decorations since 1900. We are delighted you have purchased this vintage reproduction originally designed in 1967. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is so great. So, oh man, it even says right there. So originally 1967 and then they brought it back in 2018. Oh my goodness. <sighs> And it's got gold glitter on it. Let's open this up. Pink is such a hot color right now for Christmas. I know a lot of people are doing that mid-century pink color and these would fit in so nicely. So there's six different ones, I think, and they're two-sided, but one side has this beautiful glitter on it. There's that one and this one. What song do you think she's singing? Angels we have heard on high. <laughs> and I think this one is the same. Sweetly singing on the faint. Then you have a sweet one singing with her harp. So you got two of each in that one and six total. So you could share with a friend or you could do something in a pattern. That's so cool. I love those so much. They're definitely going up in my decor this year. All right, let's dig into another one. All right, mystery box. What is next? Maybe Halloween this time? Oh my gosh! Look at how big this is, you guys. This is a witch. It's one of those jointed witches. Oh my gosh over four feet tall. She's gorgeous, you guys. I'm not gonna take her out of the package, but you can see right here. And this was originally designed in 1976. Just so much detail. She's got pumpkin earrings and fun necklaces. Of course, she's got some poison apples in her bag. That is fantastic. Oh my gosh, you guys, the cat, yes. These cats are awesome. I have been wanting the original so badly, but this is gonna do. I love this so much. These were originally designed in 1941. And I'm gonna take these out of the bag. These are great. So you have the cat playing the accordion, the guitar cat, the 
banjo cat and probably the lead singer. Look at those suspenders, so great. This is classic. When I think of the bicycle company, this image definitely pops in my head. All right, here we go again. Oh boy, oh my God, is this a pumpkin, you guys? Oh, I'm so excited. This pumpkin guy. Oh, I just might have to hang him up even though it's Christmas. I love him so much. Let's see when he was originally made. 1960. All right, I'm gonna take him out of the bag. I gotta see this guy. I This is one that I've been wanting too. All right, so let's see. Hi, little friend. Oh my gosh, this is way bigger than I anticipated. Look at him. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Isn't he just the best? Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna put him up in my room. This makes me so happy, you guys. Oh my gosh. <gasps> what a beautiful pumpkin. Do you guys have the original one? Do you guys have this reproduction? All right, let's see. Maybe we can get a Christmas one this time. Oh, ooh, check this out. This is a Halloween door banner. That is cool. I didn't even know they made these. Oh my gosh, and look at that sweet little pumpkin at the bottom. This is huge. What size is this? This says 30 inches by six foot. So that is gonna cover a lot of door. That is great. Oh my gosh, check this out. That is so neat. So it's two really big signs and they're both double-sided. And then it's got a couple of bats that you can hang. Oh my gosh, check out this witch. This is huge too. Oh my goodness. So it's printed on two sides, includes cord 12 foot. It can be used as hanging or as die cuts on the wall. That is so cool, you guys. <gasps> Yes! Oh my gosh, you guys, this reminds me of my childhood so much. My mom had these ghosts, but this is actually uh, one that goes on a tabletop, so it's a centerpiece. And this was originally created in 1975. That is so cool. You see his little rat friends right there? What do you think the ghost is pointing at? Maybe he doesn't like rats and he's like, your cheese is over there, guys, go get that. <laughs> All right, now we have some Halloween streamer. Oh my gosh, you guys, the original one for this was made in 1928. This is a close-up of all of the designs that they have. Seven inches by six foot, or two yards. I've got more balloons! <laughs> Oh, what? They sent me Easter too? Oh, you guys, thank you. Oh my gosh, what a surprise. This is huge, 32 inches. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh my gosh, it's a honeycomb Easter bunny. Oh, you guys, I hope you can see that beautiful brown and blue color. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. Is this a reproduction too? Oh my gosh, 1974. I love this. Oh man. It's huge. It's awesome. Oh my gosh, if you guys like Easter, definitely purchase this. That is the cutest little bunny rabbit ever. And his egg is blue and white. Man, that is so cool. <laughs> What is this? Ooh, wow. Oh my gosh, I gotta take these out of the bag. Let's take a closer look at this. This says originally in 1966. <gasps> these are fun. I don't know if I've seen these ones or not. So this is called a totem pole cutout. Oh my gosh, you can make a totem out of it or have them just used together or separate. Wow, let's check these out. So here we have an amazing owl. 
gosh. It's got a top hat. It's like red and orange. Even the back is a very cool color. Then we have this guy. I don't know, is this a zombie or a swamp creature? Do you guys think it is an alien? A goon? Whoa! Bad to the bone. Oh my gosh, the detail on this is just incredible. Even the cracks and the earrings. This must be the very bottom. There's the totem picture right there. So you can see how it goes together. Then we have an awesome raven and a really cool candle. Wow, that is neat. I didn't even know that existed, I think. And that is just, that is so cool. More Easter! Oh my gosh, what is this? Oh my gosh. This is adorable. It's an Easter bunny pushing a cart. And all of the eggs are the honeycomb. This one was originally designed in 1957 and it's cool. It's got all the instructions on the back and little letters so it's easy to assemble. Check out how cute the rabbit is. I love the brown color that they use for their Easter. I love it so much. Gosh, that even got some Easter. Thank you guys, that is so wonderful. Oh, Christmas! We have a little elf party. What are these guys doing? Santa and elves cutouts. Oh my gosh. These guys are great. We are delighted you have purchased this never before released vintage design. So that's cool. This is all brand new. How many pieces are in here? Five pieces and these are really good size. I mean, check out Santa right there. And a rockin' elf. <laughs> little bells on their shoes. Gosh, the detail these guys put into their illustrations is just fantastic. Halloween centerpieces. Oh my gosh, these are great. Let me open this so you can see more detail. Check, whoa, that's cool. They're 360, so look at that. This one was originally in 1929. That's neat. And then these are nice because you can just take them and hook them, just like that. Set them on your table. Oh my goodness. There is so much going on in this picture. And just like the other one, we got her back. We have some kind of a clown or jester. This one has a back too. <laughs> and a really sweet cat. This one was made in 1930. These centerpieces, oh my goodness, they are fantastic. Those are so neat. All right, we'll do one more. It is, oh wow, Halloween cats. So these were originally designed in 1973 and 1976. I'm gonna take some of these cats out of the bag. Oh wow, all of these are jointed too. This skeleton cat is amazing. Oh my gosh, I think I'm gonna have to send one of these to my stepdad. He's a radiologist and he loves cats. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. And the green is amazing. Wonder if these are black light reflective. Look at this tail. Wow, this is so awesome. Let's take a look at the other cat. Gosh, this cat is huge. This is definitely the biggest cat I own now. Wow. I love this one. These cats are, got a little attitude, don't they? Definitely don't want to meet this cat in an alley. I love the pop of color on this one. The blue, because everything that you normally have for Halloween is just like black and orange. But check out that blue really does something for this die cut, doesn't it? And that is a good size. So you get two of each in that one, I think. That's really cool. 
Well guys, that's gonna do it for the first part of this unboxing series of these Bicycle die cuts. I hope you guys will join me in the next video. If you guys aren't subscribed, please click subscribe. Also hit that notification bell so you're notified when I post the next videos. And also definitely go check out the Bicycle company. They have so many products online. I will leave a link below of where to go check them out. Go buy some stuff from them. It's awesome quality, it's beautiful illustrations and they're a family-run business made in the USA. Can't get any better than that. So I hope you guys enjoy this, and we'll see you next time.